first alert weather. All right, I'm going to lay the day out for you here. Here's what you need to know. Things will be a little cooler around here. You need your sunglasses. We're going to warm up from the 50s this morning at about 10 into the upper 50s by lunchtime and into the afternoon. We're going to peak only into the upper 60s today. So we're coming out of the 70s today. We'll be a little cooler around here and you'll feel that breeze as well as that uh, front pushes off to the north and the east of us. We'll kick the winds up. Yesterday we hit 74 degrees. Our average for this day in our seasonal percentages here is about 62 degrees. So we're above that by about 12 degrees from yesterday and today we will bring those temperatures down into the 60s. I don't think we're going to hit any records. Our overnights are above average here this morning. We're starting with 42 degrees in Jackson. So if you're going to be cruising over to that side of eastern Idaho into western Wyoming, take in the beauty. We're getting better at our leaves because the peak is happening. Just make sure you you don't you know run off the road and you're behind. If you get stuck behind somebody, it's the best time to look at the leaves. So make sure somebody in the car is responsible enough with the camera if you're going to take pictures or pull off and take pictures. Uh, it feels like it's about 37 degrees with the wind chill there in Jackson. We don't measure wind chill above 50, so some of us are at that right here this morning. We're insulated. There's some cloud cover around. The breezes are 10 to 15 to 20 miles an hour gusting to that, and they will continue through the afternoon. Now tonight we get to cool down after this front comes through. This is a freeze warning, and this will last until 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. So it's time to winterize, hypnotize, mesmerize, and otherwise as we get into what is going to be chilly weather tonight, below 32 degrees for some of us. This is a frost advisory, and we'll draw the line there into the Mid-Valley and put uh, some frost on the pumpkin. There's the front. I've placed it on the radar, and you can see where the showers are up there toward Montana and the Wyoming state line. But around here, things are dry, and we will see some cooler air invade as it begins to push eastward. It escapes again, and then we'll bring in the sunshine for the back end of the week and mild conditions. It will be in the 70s around here. So for today, with some sun mixed with clouds and some breezes to 10 to 20 plus miles an hour, it's going to be in the upper 60s to near 70 degrees. Not a bad day, just a little cooler than it was yesterday. 62 in Jackson high, 67 salmon high, 70 in Chalice. It'll be 64 in Mackey and pushing the 70 degree mark as you get into the lower valley. You retain a little bit of that warmth. You'll be under that frost advisory freeze warning for the upper valley for tonight. Here is your eight day forecast. Blackfoot headed south there on 15. It's going to be 67, a mixture of clouds and sun and below freezing tonight, 31 degrees. We'll be pushing 70 into the coming days and we'll keep it there. The thermostat is locked with some bright conditions and in Rexburg, it'll be 66. That breeze, cooler air still in play below freezing tonight with a freeze warning. Salmon 67 at cloudy and breezes with the cooler conditions into play and 34 for the evening. But then we begin the warm up as we get back into Thursday and about 74 degrees. So above average temperatures continue. Jackson will be 62 today. Pleasant, but breezy and cold tonight. It will be below freezing and in the upper 20s. But dry conditions prevail around here. And this is a long stretch of dry days. This time last year, we were amping up for a snowstorm around here in the middle of October. I know Emma is ready. She's already bought her pink shovel. Pocatello, breezy and 70 degrees. I'm trying to find one of those to uh, award you that for your year long stay here. It will be 39 tonight and low 70s for Wednesday, Thursday, and then we'll see dry conditions all the way through the period for homecoming weekend in Pocatello. So the jacket will come in handy. Cooler conditions today from yesterday's 72 or 74 degrees. We'll be down to 67 a day today. today. How many times can I say that, Jeff? In Idaho Falls. It'll be 42 tonight, and then we'll be pushing the 70 degree mark back into Thursday. What is the weirdest thing your boss has asked you to do? We want your input on the Hollaback line at 534-9957. 534-9957. And yes, the Sasquatchian family is coming up.